Hey guys, good to see you again and welcome to another video on TA Outdoors. I recently passed the 50,000 subscribers and um, just wanted to say thank you to everyone who's watching the channel, um, supporting it, commenting and things like that. Getting lots of good feedback from you guys about theory time, which we do generally at the end of our videos. Uh, so again, keep commenting and hopefully share the videos with your buddies. Today is basically a giveaway video. Um, it's a pretty monster giveaway. I recently got contacted by a fellow called Tom from campingsurvival.com. There's a website uh, link in the video description. And Tom basically, uh, it's a veteran owned company of I think 60 plus years. And uh, the website itself is pretty vast. It sells all sorts of camping and outdoor and survival gear. He does stuff varying from paracord, knives, water purification, um, all sorts of stuff. I mean, there's literally everything camping wise you can think of is almost on the website. <clears throat> but today is a giveaway video. And Tom's basically sent me over a box uh, from the US uh, and what he does is like a monthly giveaway on his website and it's all obviously is a giveaway so it's free very easy to enter the giveaway but we'll do that at the end of the video and I'll uh, explain how you can enter it uh, but I'll just show you the stuff that uh, Tom sent me here I've got a box out into the woods I'm here in my bushcraft camp and uh, I might get a fire going in a minute and maybe put coffee on uh, it's a weekend so why not but hopefully you enjoy the gear and without further ado let's check it out getting a wet ass on this log damn it right <clears throat> I'm just gonna go uh, grab things from the box and just show you them as I pick them up so first things first we've got military style canteen um, this is one quart plastic lined polyester cover and Alice keeper clips just there you can see them the Alice for the uh, Alice straps and things like that this is my one of my favorites I really like this one a compact fisherman folding fishing pole. It's like a fishing rod, but it's really compact and you can see there uh, how it folds out. And I'm actually going to definitely give this a go on my other channel, TA Fishing probably, but it's got a neat little winder, little uh, reel there as well. It's quite compact. I think that's pretty neat. Don't know how much line it stores, uh, but it's got a notch so you can carry it on your belt. There's a dude there just ha hanging it from his belt, which is pretty cool. Um, so the folded length is nine and a quarter inches and it extends up to 17 inches. Perfect for kayaking, canoeing, hiking and camping. Quiet, smooth action reel with adjustable star drag. Includes hooks, fishing line and free practice casting plug. A mini tackle box for extra lures and hooks and obviously the built-in belt hook. Really cool, like that. A life straw. I don't know if you guys have ever heard of these but they're pretty, pretty impressive and they're fairly massive nowadays. Um, these basically help to pu almost purify water as you drink it. Um, so you can see from the diagram there, hopefully. Uh, you can. There's videos of people drinking from uh, puddles, basically really dirty puddles, uh, and it just filters the water for you, and it basically comes through really clean. And I've used them, I've got one as well, actually, myself. Um, I think there's another brand, there's other brands out there, but this is probably the most popular brand. Really, really helpful, long, thin, easy to store in your backpack, and saves you having to use boil up water and use purification tablets so probably better for those of you that go out hiking i would say and things like that um, where you need water access fairly quickly and you're not in a long-term camp but life straw pretty good pretty good giveaway there next up is the first aid kit definitely in fact the most important part of your, any person's camping or survival kit is your first aid kit it's a nice bright red casing which to be honest, I always prefer with first aid kits, you wanna be able to find it quickly if you are injured. Uh, fairly big for a first aid kit, it's one to four people, and there's everything on here from 12 antiseptic wound wipes, compass button, liquid field, rescue howler whistle, loads and loads of bandages and dressings, tape, sterile pads, blister pads, um, cold packs, scissors, bandages, pretty much everything you need. Although it is big, it's fairly narrow, so again, it's pretty, Pretty easy to pack in your backpack and I would put this probably down the back of your backpack so that it sits against your back, almost like an extra bit of padding. But nice first aid kit there with a little carrying handle. Going along with that, Beast, the Beast Survival Medicine Handbook. This is written by Joseph Alton, MD and Amy Alton. And it is thick. In fact, it's over 650 odd pages thick and it's got absolutely everything about survival medicine from natural plants uh, all the way through to what to do in emergency. Uh, it's, it's actually really, really good. It's got some diagrams in there as well. Hopefully you guys can see that. It's got little diagrams and things of, of different lices, ticks, bugs. <sighs> Unbelievable. Patient transport, carrying people, how to carry people on stretchers, wooden stretchers and things like that made out in the woods. 
wow that's going to take some reading that one but very interesting very very interesting and we've got a little card pack here called wild cards all ages edible wild foods uh, it's an identification card pack i believe and actually there's a there's a little hole there i don't know if you can see that and they provide a chain so you can put that chain around the hole there and then either cling it to your waist or your backpack uh, great for kids and great for beginners as well i'll definitely have a good look through there might be specific to certain areas of the world but again uh, improving your knowledge in the bushcraft uh, area of expertise is always uh, important you know it's always good to try and expand your knowledge i'm always keen to learn so wild edibles card identification gotta love these solar wind up radio and it's got a little wind up here Now I've not tuned this obviously, but it's got a little, I can see the antenna there just tucked away. Just there. Generally they uh, can last quite a while and fairly small. Again, easily comp compactable. Depends whether you like, uh, go, whether you prefer listening to music and the radio out in the woods or whether you're just a quiet person you just enjoy the ambient sound of the woods. Either way, it's kind of good to have and maybe uh, put it in a backpack for a hiking trip with a friend maybe or something like that. Very useful solar wind up radio. Next up, next up, oh, canteen. Obviously to go with your your uh, water container. Nice, simple canteen. I believe it's aluminium. Very, very lightweight. I'd say that's aluminium, definitely. Always handy, these things. Always useful when you can put a stick, split a stick. If you split a stick and you can pinch it in there and it keeps those handles together and you can hang it above your fire just like that. Maybe I'll show you that for you, uh, you guys one day. Canteen. It's a canteen cup, really, isn't it? Canteen cup. And I wonder, actually. It could almost nest with the bottle there, I believe. If I took the wrapping off, it would probably nest in that. Dead handy. A blast match. Really, really good. They work in the wet. Um, and you just basically aim them at the ground and push them. You just lift your thumb on a certain lever push it into your tinder bundle and it sparks in the rain and it's really good for lighting tinder bundles when they're wet very very useful especially for the uh, survivalists out there blast match 12 led mini flashlight nice and small nice and compact uh, it's got 5000 working hours per led good rubber grip and requires three AAA batteries again nice and small easily to put in your backpack uh, asap 365 silver gel ultimate skin and body care cosmetic product I'm guessing this would be for your uh, cuts and grazes, but as well as any cracks in your skin, on your hands, in the cold winter months, um, and also in the sun. You know, you do, you, your hands can crack and dry out in the heat. So, uh, actually, not, I've not really heard of this in many uh, survival and camping packs, but probably a very useful item. Silver Solution, immune system support, scientifically tested. Uh, help, I guess, boost your immune system with uh, some supplements there. Stop you getting ill out in the woods. Keep your immune system boosted. Keep you fit and healthy. Can never have too many of these. Emergency survival blanket. Always, always great to have. Impossible to get back in their packet after you've opened them, but really, really good piece of kit. Helps reflect that heat back off the fire, back into your sleeping or camping area. A couple of light sticks. Actually quite a good idea, you could hang these at your camp and if you went out to collect firewood you then can look for the glow of your light stick in the distance, help yourself find camp again, very useful. I would probably use these night fishing as well. I quite like this. Surgical instrument kit, minor surgery, and it's actually in a really nice little canvas bag there. And it has uh, all sorts of pairs, scissors, tweezers, scalpels, scalpel blades, skin holders, alcohol wipes, and a pen light as well there, nice little pen light. Really useful piece of kit in a nice canvas bag. Next up, getting there, Chlorflock water purification. These are sachets, they're not tablets, uh, but you pour one 600 milligram sachet to one liter of water um, and you leave it for a shaken leave for a minute and then leave for three minutes, swirl for 30 seconds, then wait seven minutes and uh, yeah, purify your water. Always important to have, especially if you're going to an area that's unfamiliar to you and you don't know what the water source is going to be like. I've heard about these things, they're called Luminate, and you can see it's already, there's a, actually a green light already on there. And you charge it, it's just a luminous piece of material, like a bag. You charge it for, you can see the solar panel there, you charge it for about seven hours, I think, seven to ten hours, and then you can blow it up 
um, and it's waterproof and it can float and it's basically like a big light um, really really cool useful piece of kit um, I've personally I'm going to test this out because I've never used one of these but I have heard good things about them but it's actually it's a nice bright day today and you can see that it's charging the lights on there so unfortunately I don't have seven to ten hours but I'll let that charge up uh, you should look this up guys they're really really useful quite a cool piece of kit another light stick there it says it lasts about 12 hours that's a green one 12 hours is a long time for light stick a nice large stuff sack uh, this is 35.5 centimeters by 76 centimeters so that is a big stuff sack always a handy I sometimes have them in my backpacks just to create an extra waterproof lining so that if my backpack got soaked all my gear that's inside the stuff sack would hopefully stay dry uh, generally also very good for if you need to pack away from camp quickly shove everything into the stuff sack bosh there you go good for putting sleeping bags in as well always handy I think we're at the last item guys and it is bada bing bada boom a nice black lightweight backpack and it's called the Rothko Deluxe Day Pack so it's a nice day pack easy kind of bucket pouch there it's got small side zip pouches on the side here two zip pouches at the front fairly big front compartment and some straps padded straps at the back there so guys that is everything in the giveaway which you can win in this big box here Tom does a giveaway every month it does change up every now and then uh, but it's a pretty monster giveaway and it's so easy to enter now this is the important part uh, at the moment I think Tom's doing this giveaway for people in the US and Canada um, I know a lot of the viewers on my channel are from the US and from Canada um, to enter his giveaway you need to go to www.campingsurvival.com uh, there's a link in the description so just go to Tom's website and uh, on the left hand side of generally on the front page somewhere there's a section that says monthly giveaway you click that and then literally all you need to do is just enter your email and you're in the giveaway he does it every month uh, but also if you're not in the US or Canada do go and check out Tom's website he's got some really really useful pieces of camping gear hiking gear survival kits everything like that something that I need to mention is uh, there's a few items that I don't have in my box here and that's because I can't get them in the country that I'm at uh, Tom can't send them and that is the fish meds uh, and food as well so you do get fish meds and food in the giveaway however uh, depending on where you live you may not get those items uh, but there is there is a full list of all the items in the video description below uh, and also on Tom's giveaway uh, the website campingsurvival.com so be sure to uh, just check that and if you don't receive those items that's because they you can't get them Tom can't send them to your the country that you live in but hopefully you've enjoyed the video and make sure you get involved in the epic giveaway uh, there are more overnighters coming I've got one planned here at the bushcraft camp coming up soon uh, and then I've got some further out into the woods with a uh, hammock and tarp and also just tarp as well on its own spring is now around the corner the buds are starting to pop out on the trees uh, the temperatures are starting to warm up and there's lots more bird song I've noticed and more animal activity around in the woodland well guys thanks very much for watching and I'll see you soon in another video